Ah. <laughs> Hello and welcome back to the Reality Check VR video. Today we're going to be looking at a 3D printing pen. And uh, I have a special guest with me today actually. It's pretty cool. I've got my sister Adelie here all the way from Denver, Colorado. That's right. She came here specifically to help me unbox this 3D <laughs> yeah. printing pen. She is very good at arts and crafts, so I figured she could actually help me do something a little cooler than what I would do by myself. Let's go ahead and open it up. What should we open it with? What do you have? I right, so you got to fidget spinner real fast. <laughs> Super speed! <laughs> Super speed! <laughs> So let's go ahead and open up the box then. Okay. Oh. Slow down with it, you're moving too fast. There, hold on, here we go. And here we have the back of it right there. That's where the plastic is going to be inserted here near the top. And then right on the bottom there is where you've got your power plug. Here we have the LCD screen, which is gonna tell you the speed as well as the temperature of the device. The nozzle is a 0.6 millimeter nozzle. The yeah, power plug, okay, yes. I must help her open the sack! <laughs> Accomplished! <laughs> yep, cool stuff. Need scissors. Oh, amazing! <laughs> it looks so real, that was good editing. Oh no, you broke the filament! Oh, that fidget spinner is too powerful. It's too powerful. Right. Look, they gave us a free slinky! Yeah, nice. the 3D printer comes with a free tangled slinky. That's pretty sweet. Yeah. Alright, as soon as you plug it in, it actually says on the LED screen PLA, which means it's actually going to be charging up for PLA. So here's how it works, folks. Okay, so when you first plug the pen in, like I said, it says PLA on it, and when you actually hit the pen side over here, you can switch it to ABS, or we'll go back to PLA. So this uh, button over here on the right side of it, the single button is what switches it between the two plastic modes. When you go over here to preheat it, you actually just are going to have to hit the up button and it's going to turn red. Once it turns red, that means it's preheating and you can actually read the temperature on the side. Right now it says it's 50 degrees and it goes up quite quickly. As I'm looking at it, it's going 60, 70 degrees, it's already at 80 degrees, so it goes up very, very steadily. So we'll see about how long it takes to get to the temperature. Okay, it's been about 30 seconds since we started and it's at 150 degrees right now. All right, so the light just turned green, it's now at 200 degrees. So at 200 degrees, it took right about a minute, maybe less than a minute to get there, pretty quick. Now make sure the ends <laughs> are cut very smoothly. They said, make sure your ends are cut smooth. This is how they gave it to us. That looks pretty it's smooth, doesn't it? Sweet. It looks pretty smooth. Go ahead and try it again. Okay, so what you want to do is you want to make sure and actually hit the forward button, because the forward button is what's going to start feeding the plastic into the pen. And if you want it to stop, you'll just hit that same button again, and that's what stops it. So. Now that we have the plastic actually in there, as you can see coming out the back, we should be able just to hit this button right here. And here in a little moment or two, we should be able to see some plastic coming out here at the end. Yep. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Oh, 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 that was fast. And hot. Hot and fast. <laughs> Don't touch it. All right, also, if you are going to want to go at different speeds, you can press the right button, which changes the speeds a bit. And we're going to go ahead and play around with it a little bit and see if we can't make something. You could make friendship bracelets. Directly onto somebody's skin. <laughs> yeah, should I try to adjust with it or should I try first? You should try first, probably. Because obviously you can't. You gotta like, in the things it shows it like you make a little dot and then you can go up and stuff like that. You gotta go slow, I guess. That's working. Oh, nice! No, that's not really nice. I mean, it's working better than it was when we first tried a few seconds ago. 